I can't tell you how long I've been wanting to say this, but boys and girls, it's time for some Minecraft. Now, I'm not really in my Minecraft phase quite yet. I get random Minecraft phases where I'm into it for like a month, but I just figured either way, I want to make a video for you guys. So here are 10 cool and creative Minecraft ideas that you guys can make right now. Now, I did 10 other designs like about a year ago, so check out that video, but these are 10 completely new ones up to the nether update, so no caves and cliffs update in this video. That's gonna be for a separate one. Anyway, these are some cool designs that I've used in the past and other ones that I plan on using in the future. So anyway, let's check these out, boys and girls. Now, LEGO makes nether portals for their sets, but I want to take the ones they make and take them to a whole nother level. So here's a much more detailed version. I made my own version using a lot of tiles, plates, and these purple studs. I got to use the actual panel that comes from the sets. It's just a nice transparent purple one it fits so well with the colors a very detailed design a step up from the Lego set one and uh, I just want to show this to you guys here are two little fishies boys and girls these are all brick built the first one is a salmon I used a white tile on the bottom for the belly of the fish for the fins I use some tiles the back one is held on by this clip and then everything else is just built using some one by one bricks and then this next one is Nemo to make this I used some pretty simple pieces like some one by one plates but anyway I freaking love fishies this next Next design is really simple and this is a spawner. Now the spawners in the Lego sets are made using these railing pieces so if you don't have enough room for a big spawner you can make this tinier version which uses four of these tap pieces and if you put some mobs around it, it really compensates for that spawn look. So if you're ever making a dungeon, a nether fortress and you want a spawner then here's the design for you guys. Here are some simple lighting designs. The one on the very left is a end rod. This is the one that you find in the end cities after you defeat the dragon. This next one is like this prismarite light I forgot the name but you find it in the underwater ocean monuments and then there's also a magma cube and a simple torch and then to spice things up even more here is a lantern piece from the nether update they added these chains that you can hang the lanterns from so that's kind of what I wanted to do here with this uh, with the short chain piece now I usually try not to like modify my pieces but I painted these ones for a specific reason because I wanted to recreate a shulker so here are some simple shulkers they literally use a few two by two plates and then in the very middle, I actually used the Steve head piece from the old school Minecraft sets. If you don't have that, you can just use a regular tan plate. To get the paint, I literally used this acrylic one from uh, Walmart. And they're literally like 75 cents a bottle. I believe I mixed blue, red, and maybe a little bit of black. I'm not sure. Here's a design I really like. This is a warped tree. Simple tree design that uses some colors I love, like some teal and also this like aqua blue. I have some tiles and plates hanging from the edge by the snot plates and then to add some extra little features to this build I added a piglin some fire just to you know and some lava to make it look like it's actually the nether for this next design here is a simple campfire I just crisscrossed some 1 by 3 plates and then on the very top I laid down this minecraft piece that comes in the sets it's just some simple fire if you want to you can add some smoke so to do that just take some transparent bricks take some white pieces and kind of pattern them so it looks like smoke clouds are going up. Here's a simple lectern design which uses this book tile which uh, I believe originally came in like an enchanting table from a Minecraft set but I used it in a lectern this time around. To give the lectern this angle I used this hinged piece. It doesn't really match with the rest of the color which is why I have two bookshelves on the side kind of keeping it hidden but either way it's a cool design and if you're making a library this fits perfectly. This isn't my favorite build I've done but it works and it looks realistic. Here is a simple cauldron on the right uh, which uses a snot brick technique and some transparent plates and then also a brewing stand with three potion bottles hanging if you want a realistic simple brewing station then try this out for yourself and for the final design this one is probably my favorite this is a simple end portal so similar to the nether portal I used a lot of plates and a lot of studs but the geometry of this build is kind of whack but it looks cool once you have it figured out essentially the first layer is a two by two two space and then I make a cross pattern for the second layer third layer is just black two by two brick fourth layer once again the same cross and then the fifth layer is a two by two brick once you figure out the design you'll get this down and it looks really cool if you put like an enderman next to it because it just really complements that the end vibe anyway
anyway, boys and girls, those were the 10 designs. What's your favorite Minecraft design? Let me know. I'm really looking forward to the new update coming out because um, I actually want to do a video on that specifically. Anyway, stay tuned, boys and girls. I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching and stay spicy.